Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best paddle boards. Starting at number 5. Boat HD Aero Inflatable. Boat calls the HD Aero their do everything board, and we'd have to agree. We found the HD Aero incredibly stable and could definitely be a solid board for yoga or fishing. The upshot? This board is a ton of fun and is suitable for beginners. For its size, we found it surprisingly maneuverable and fast. It handled the wind and chop very well. And with a rider capacity of 315 pounds, this board can easily handle an adult with a child or dog. Boat also has quite a few neat features that make this board stand out compared to other non-boat boards on this list. The board comes rack compatible which is Boat's way of adding a tackle rack or bucket rack to turn normal SUPs into Fishing Focus's SUPs. It also has a sheath to hold your paddle while on the board, attachment points to store a cooler or a seat. A magnet attachment point also connects with Boat's drinkware and other accessories. Coming at number 4. Serene Life Tabla Day. Serene Life's inflatable SUP is a good one for entry-level to experienced paddlers. It has all the basics a Euro, a board, paddle, pump, repair kit, leash, and additional fin. Our tester had no problem pumping it up to 12 PSI in less than 10 minutes. And the paddle was easy to adjust, even while standing on the board in the water. This board features superior stability a Euro. Our tester had no problem taking it on a windy lake and river while riding it in tandem with a partner and antsy dog. That jumped off the board multiple times. We took this board camping and on a four-day river trip, and besides some scratches and marks from transporting it in and out of the river, it held up well. Although it has some light scuff marks, it feels super durable, our tester reported. Our nitpicks a euro, like other boards on this list a euro, are the bag could be bigger and easier for putting the board away at the end of the day. But, overall, you'll be hard-pressed to find a better board for its cost. At number 3. Rock Tublas de Remo. There's a lot to love about this board from ROC. And don't let the budget superlative totally define this board. It's a solid board that our tester tried alongside another board double its price. And the ROC inflatable SUP more than held its own. Of the two boards I tested, our tester reported, this one was better in terms of features. In particular, our tester enjoyed the front and rear bungee tie-downs, how easy the fin was to attach and detach via the board's quick-clip fin, and the included dry bag, which was handy for carrying a phone and car keys during a paddle sesh. Bonus, this board comes with a convertible paddle for paddleboarding and kayaking. Our tester had no problem inflating the board to capacity in less than 10 minutes. This board performed really well, our tester said. It felt stable, it turned well, and I felt like I could go pretty fast when I wanted. It was also easy to carry and features front and rear handles for a duo to carry if necessary. Number 2 of my list. All Pioneer, Tabla. Everything about Isle's new version of the Pioneer is easy. This board was super simple to use, from unpacking and inflating to actually paddling to deflating and packing back up. The package includes a leash, fin, pump, paddle, and bag. We love features like front and rear handles so two people can share the load. Bungees on both ends for carrying water bottles, life jackets, or extra clothing. And two Velcro straps on the side to hold your paddle while carrying the board. On the water, this board performed very well. Its 6-inch loft and 34-inch width make it stable. One of our testers had no problem casting a fly rod and catching small brook trout from it while testing on a high alpine lake in Colorado's Summit County. We also had no significant issues with it while navigating the surf off the Ventura County coast. Its maneuverability was also top-notch and seemed to cut through the wind decently enough. And number 1. Atal Tabla de Remo. From the Buffalo Icon logo to the extra thick and burly build, the Atoll ISUP is a heavy-duty paddleboard. Larger paddlers can struggle with boards with thinner profiles and lower maximum capacities. Not so with the Atoll, which is a full 6 inches thick, 32 inches wide, 
and rated up to 400 pounds for a single rider and 750 pounds for two. The board is also performance oriented for its size, with a squared tail and pointed nose for better planning and steering. The thruster fin setup lets you get moving and keep moving straight ahead when you need to cover ground. Many deering attachment points and built-in elastic straps will help tie down your gear. We found the included fiberglass paddle is high quality, and the leash feels like one you'd find on a surfboard. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.